Well, if someone is wondering why to vaccinate against the rotavirus infection, um, I have a few answers that I hope will uh, clarify the issue. Why to vaccinate? I mean, uh, rotavirus infection is extremely frequent. By five years of age, every child, every child already encountered this virus. And when you meet the virus, not often is very pleasant it can end up into severe disease and hospitalization. The uh, virus uh, uh, infection happens very early in life, so it is very important to prevent this infection very, very early. We have two vaccines against rotavirus, and both are extremely efficacious. Uh, what we have already seen is that uh, efficacy of these two vaccines is up to 90% in preventing severe disease. So both vaccines are extremely efficacious to prevent severe disease and hospitalization. So why we are not vaccinating every child against rotavirus? There are several problems, and one of the main issues is related to the fear that someone can uh, have about uh, vaccine safety. This is because we have uh, bad memories of one antirotavirus vaccine that performed not, get, not that well in terms of safety, and it was the old vaccine, RotaShield. The new vaccines that we are using today in our vaccination programs are completely different, are new vaccines, and the safety profile of these two vaccines has been thoroughly uh, explored and investigated. There are already a lot of data that have been collected in the pre-authorization trials, large trials, both in the northern and in the uh, southern hemisphere, uh, already demonstrated that uh, there is no big safety signal for these uh, vaccines. What is the safety signal? The fear is about intersusception. Intersusception is a condition, a medical condition, that can be also severe and uh, lead to hospitalization. Fortunately, this event is very rare and naturally, naturally happens very early in, in life and has a peak in incidence normally, independently from vaccination, normally intersusception can happen usually with a peak around three, four months of age. So what about the vaccines? The vaccines that we are using already demonstrated that has have no link with the intersusception during the preclinical trial. During the use of these vaccines in the, in the practice, so in the post-marketing surveillance, we know that if you use this vaccine as per schedule, so giving the first dose at six weeks of age and very early, in the vaccination schedule, the risk for increasing the risk for intersusception is close to zero. So the main advice is vaccinate against rotavirus because this is a nasty disease and a very, very frequent disease. And second advice is vaccinate very early so you forget about the even very low risk of intersusception.